Hello, hello, hello. OMG, welcome back to my channel. So excited that you are here. I got some great stuff to share with you about Walgreens today. Oh my goodness. Uh, it's Jody Dunn, and I'm coming at you with my Sunday Walgreens haul. I'm filming in the car again. I feel like I've been doing more intros in the car. I'm going to be taking the girls to a fair. It's not a fair in my town, but it's not very far away. And they're super excited. So I wanted to get here early, get this filmed, and not worry about filming the intro at home. So we're filming it here. If you are new and you just found the channel, I am so happy you are here. Would you please say hello to me and let me know that you are new right down there. I would love to welcome you to the channel and say hello back to you. So I'm going to be doing two different transactions today. On one card, uh, I did not get a digital spend booster. So sometimes you guys comment and you say, I didn't get a digital spend booster. What a bummer. And I say, mm, it's random. That's how it goes. <laughs> like, so just so you know, I did not, on my main account, I did not get a digital spend booster. And when I say main account, it's like the first account I had. It's the one I used the most. I did not get a digital spend booster this week. I did last week um, get a paper spend booster, thank goodness. Um, but I am gonna be using, on one of my accounts, I did get a spend 50, earn $10. So we're gonna do a pretty awesome transaction on that card. Um, a newer promotion. I'm so excited to share it with you. We got a new gift card promotion with Activate Rewards. You know I love those. And um, that's it. So I'm going to show you a transaction that I personally did on my account that did not receive a spend booster, just using Walgreens cash to pay for some essentials. And then I'm going to show you an awesome transaction. Plus we're going to be testing out, do we still got the double dip going on on the deal of the week like we did last week? If you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. Let's run into Walgreens and see what we're going to grab today. All right, we are in the Walgreens. I'm so excited about this first deal. Uh, we're going to the oral care aisle. I am working with a spend 50, earn $10 back in Walgreens cash. I know we're all sick of oral care. I'm not getting toothpaste today. My store restocked on the Vivid Whitening OMG. So I'm gonna be testing out today if the double dip is still happening like it did last week with the deal of the week, where if you purchase four participating products, you earn back a uh, two $5 store coupons. And we already know that this deal is not only coded with the buy three, earn back a $5 store coupon weekly deal, it's actually, actually a monthly deal, but it's also coded with the spend 10, earn a $5 register reward on certain oral care products. So at $3 each, these total me $12. So I will be spending 10. And remember, when you are receiving back a register reward, it never ever matters how you pay. You can pay with Walgreens cash. I will not be today because I am working with my digital spend booster of spend 50, earn 10. And I've used up all my digital coupons, so I have no coupons for this Oral B. OMG, I'm still getting it. Uh, we got the same double dip happening with the $4 floss picks. However, all of my stores are totally wiped out. I still have a dang $6 coupon. I hope they restock soon. All right, here's the deal I'm so excited about. Yes, we got another Listerine promotion. Thank you so much to Sakethia. She emailed me uh, the beginning of last week and let me know we were gonna have a new Activate Rewards promotion happening, OMG. The Listerine is on promotion for spend 10, earn back $5 in Walgreens cash. And we have a register reward promotion for this. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab two of these at $8.79 and I'm gonna go ahead and grab two of these at $6.49. So these four total me $30.56. Another product I have no coupons for, OMG. Since I'm spending 30, I will earn back $15 in Walgreens cash. And we still have that promotion going on 
similar to the one we did previously, not quite as good. But if you spend $30 in participating products, you earn back a $5 register reward. Remember the one day that it was double dipping with the $10 register reward? That was amazing. And we have a new Activate Rewards promotion. If you go to activaterewards.com backslash summer essentials, there are a whole bunch of products included in on this promotion. Listerine is just one of them. And it is buy $25 worth of products and you earn back a $10 Visa gift card. So between Walgreens Cash, the $5 register reward, and the $10 Visa card, I'm looking to get back $30. These cost $30.56. So they would all end up costing me 56 cents for all four of them, which is insane. But I am pairing this in with some spend boosters, so it's gonna make it a nice little money maker. All right, I need two more products to test out if the deal of the week is still double dipping and producing two $5 store coupons in the same transaction if you purchase six products. Because remember, the promotion is buy three, earn back a $5 store coupon. Well, the Tresemme products are included. We do have a digital coupon that is attaching to like the stylers. I almost was gonna get that. But I'm gonna go ahead, because I'm using some register rewards in this transaction, I'm gonna go ahead and grab the shampoo and conditioner. They are on sale this week for $4.99. And that way I can use a paper coupon because it doesn't look like the paper coupon is valid off of the stylers. And you can always search coupontom.com to find out what coupons any insert or what inserts any coupons come from. I'm gonna go ahead and use the $5 off two Tresemme coupon. That is literally the only coupon I have for this transaction. So my total for all these products is $50.56. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this paper spend booster of spend 35, earn $8 in Walgreens cash. And I have four $4 register rewards that I am also going to be using because I don't have coupons for almost all of these products. And then I'm also going to be using my $10 gift card that I got. Did you guys get your gift card in the mail for that promotion that we did? Um, it took about a month to get this. I'm still waiting on one more gift card. Let me know if you got yours. And because that is an actual gift card, you can use it on spend deals. It works the same as cash. And stay tuned, we've got another Walgreens gift card promotion coming soon. My friend Crystal sent me an email uh, like two weeks ago. Her store already had signs up. At the end of July, we're going to have another similar promotion to be able to earn back more Walgreens gift cards. I'm so excited. Now, I could technically use more register rewards in this transaction, but the only register rewards I have are from the $5 Crest deal, which is a monthly deal of spend 10, earn back five. And I'm not sure if that one, if I would get another one. So I'm not gonna chance it. And then I also have a $5 register reward from doing the Listerine promotion previously. But again, because I'm doing the same deal, I'm not going to use that register reward on it. So I will go ahead and pay any balance owed with my PayPal debit card. All right, we're gonna move on to transaction number two. Now we have a deal going on with Dove this week that I'm not gonna do today. But basically they are buy one, get one half price. And they are buy two, earn back a $2, um, $2 in Walgreens cash. We did get buy one, get one free coupons today for buy one women's, get one men's free. I wanted to give you a heads up on this deal if you use one of these $5 store coupons, this always confuses people. If the cashier scans the buy one, get one free coupon versus manually entering it, it will take off the max value of $6.49. But if you use that $5 store coupon, that coupon is a discount. It will literally lower the price of each one of your products. So now your coupon will take off a less amount. People get very confused about this and they wonder why their coupon didn't take off the $6.49. That's why. 
What we are gonna do in this transaction is an awesome deal on the soft soap. They are on sale for $3.99 each, and they are buy two, earn back $5 in Walgreens cash. So I am doing this on the account that I got no digital spend booster and I have no additional paper spend boosters to use either. So I'm gonna grab these two at $3.99 each. So they will total $7.98. I'm gonna use these two $1 paper coupons that just came out today. I'll pay $5.98 and earn back $5 in Walgreens cash. It makes them just 49 cents each, which is awesome. All right, the next deal that I wanted to go ahead and do uh, was on the paper products. Now, this also includes the Tide, but I do not have my PNG yet. OMG. So I'm going to focus on the paper products. Um, so the Bounty Essentials is $4.95. I was really hoping the four equals eight rolls was included. It is not. The two equals five rolls is included. Although the regular Bounty is way better quality than the Bounty Essentials, I'm not gonna grab the two equals five. So I'm gonna grab two packages of the Bounty Essentials, six equals eight rolls. And this deal is buy four, earn back a $6 register reward. So you can grab the Bounty, the Charmin, these little packs of Charmin are included, the four equals 16 rolls. And then these bigger packs of the Charmin Essentials are also included. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab two packages of the Charmin Essentials. And I have a $1 digital coupon off of the Charmin, and I also have a $1 digital coupon off of the Bounty. And then the last thing that I'm gonna use in this transaction, I've got my two paper coupons for the Soft Soap, is um, I'm loaded up with all these dang store coupons, so I'm definitely gonna be using one of these $5 store coupons in this transaction, which will just come off as a store discount. And remember, you can only use one store discount per transaction. So whether that's one of these store coupons, a percent off coupon, anything like that, it is one per transaction. All right, this is going to finish up my Sunday Walgreens haul. Let's head to the kitchen table and go over these receipts. But before we do, I wanted to make sure that you were aware of this. Last time we were doing the promotion, there were a few of you that did not get your register rewards for this Listerine promotion. And I noticed that your barcodes on your Listerine were different than mine. So there must be maybe new barcodes that are not coded with the register reward deal. So I put a picture up of the Cool Mint barcode and the Total Care barcode. So if you buy these products, make sure that your barcodes are the same numbers as mine because this did produce the register reward. All right, we are back at the kitchen table. There's Gus standing there and Viv. Say hi, Viv. <laughs> There's Gus and Viv for any of y'all that like to see them. All right, we've got two transactions to go over here. And I want to let you know what worked and what didn't work. So in the first transaction, I got the Listerine. Super excited. We got a new Activate Rewards promotion. Again, that website is activaterewards.com backslash summer essentials. I'll leave it in the post it in the description box as well. That is a limit of three. It includes so many products. So you can look through the list. There are a ton, a ton of products included in on that promotion. So I'll definitely be maxing the deal out with other products as well. But I wanted to do the Listerine deal as well because we got that promotion, because it is on Walgreens Cash, and because we are getting back that $5 register reward. Now, remember, I showed you previously a Catalina that had printed out of the Catalina machine for me. It was an advertisement. Unfortunately, it did not give me any dates of how long that promotion goes. And it also did not give me a website like our last one did where you can go and see what products are included. Um, the reason I knew the deal was still going on is because in Walgreens ad, it is literally listed um, under Neutrogena and I think Clean and Clear that if you spend 30, you earn back a $5 register reward. Well, that's what this deal is. It also includes the Listerine. So because it was in the ad, I knew the deal was still going on. Otherwise, we don't I don't have any dates to know when that promotion is good towards. 
And then I wanted to test out the double dip. I was so excited to see my store restocked with the toothbrushes. Gosh, I hope they restock with the floss picks. I got dang good coupons to be able to use off those, but my stores literally are all out. But they did have the Vivid Whitening, which I did decide to go ahead and grab, even though I had already used up all of my digital coupons because I knew I would be getting back at least $10 for those. But I was going to test and see if the double dip was happening last week when we purchased six products in the same transaction. It did produce five, two $5 store coupons. Normally, it will only produce one store coupon or one register reward per deal per transaction, okay? So let's take a look at my receipt. So there are my four toothbrushes at $3 each. There's my two Tresemme. There's my two Listerine at $6.49 each and my two at $8.79 each. These are both regularly priced. You could go ahead and use a 20% off coupon, a 25% off coupon. You could use a $5 store discount that we've been earning a ton of but it will affect your spend deal. I literally was only at $30.56. So to be able to use any type of store discount in this transaction, I would have had to add more products to get me to my $30 spend requirement to earn back my $5 register reward. It never matters how you pay when you're earning back a register reward, but you do have to get your product total to the required spend amount and store discounts do not count towards that spend amount, okay? So I had my $5, um, I had the cashier scan the points booster, had my $5 coupon off of Tresemme and I used those four register rewards that I told you about. So my subtotal was $31.54. I used that $10 gift card that we earned. So on my PayPal debit card, I paid a subtotal of $21.54. Let's take a look at what I earned back. I earned back $33.52 in Walgreens cash on this transaction. So I earned back $10 for my digital spend booster of spend 50, earn 10. I earned back $8 for my paper spend booster of spend 35, earn 8. Those two stack. And then I earned another $15 in Walgreens cash because I spent $30 in Listerine products. The deal is... Every $10 you spend, you earn back $5 in Walgreens cash. When it is giving back Walgreens cash, you can do multiple of the same deal and, and earn back multiple rewards. And the Catalina machine started printing and I heard it print four times. So I was like, OMG, <sighs> I got a 20% off coupon. That was one of my prints. <laughs> I'm grateful for this coupon. I earned back a $5 store coupon. The deal of the week, purchased three participating products, earned back a $5 store coupon. I earned back a $5 register reward, compliments of P&G, because I spent over $10 and that deal is coded with two different deals. We already know this. We've been doing this for a, close to a month now. And then I earned a $5 register reward. Did I say register reward? This one's a register reward. And then a $5 register reward, Thank you from Neutrogena. But again, it includes way more products than just Neutrogena. It's like Neutrogena, Aveeno, um, Clean and Clear. It includes the Listerine, a whole bunch of things. I did not get two $5 store coupons. So it's one of two things. Either the deal of the week is not glitching this week and producing multiple store coupons in the same transaction or maybe the Tresemme is coded wrong. I'm not entirely sure. If you purchase the Tresemme as part of a deal of the week, would you let me know if you got back a $5 store coupon by only purchasing three products? I don't care what else you purchase, Tresemme and a Crest or whatever. Would you please let me know if you get back a $5 store coupon? My guess is it's probably not glitching, but it could be that the Tresemme is coded wrong. I'm not entirely sure. All right, and then submitted my receipt to the activaterewards.com backslash summer essentials for a $10 Visa gift card. Now, remember on those Activate Rewards, there are no exclusions of using any coupons. So it doesn't matter if I use Walgreens Cash. It doesn't matter if I use coupons. I will still get back my $10 Visa gift card. So if we break this transaction down, I paid $21.54 
but my subtotal was $31.54 plus the $16 in register rewards I used. So my cost for this transaction was $47.54. That was my cost. I earned back $33.52 in Walgreens cash, a $5 store coupon, $10 in register rewards, and a $10 Visa gift card. So I earned a total back of $58.52, and it cost $47.54. So it makes this transaction free plus a $10.98 moneymaker. I was kind of anticipating it was going to be a $15.98 moneymaker because I just thought for sure the tail of the week was going to double dip again, but it did not. So it's fine. $10 moneymaker for four Listerines. I will take it. You can do um, this deal multiple different ways if you want to get the Listerine. I could have built my transaction up. I could have used Walgreens cash to pay and still earned back all my Walgreens cash. Check the description box. There is a link of how to use Walgreens cash on spend deals. I did not do that in this transaction because I didn't want to build my transaction up to, usually I like to double it. So I would have had to build my transaction up to $100. You don't have to double it. Anyways, there are several different ways to do this promotion. So if, you, if you're not flooded with Listerine and you want to do the Listerine, it is a great week to do the Listerine. If you already have enough and you don't want to do the Listerine, I totally get it. But we go through Listerine often and... Although the last couple of months, we have been seeing some great deals with um, register rewards that have been popping up and gift cards that have been popping up. We don't get deals on Listerine all that often. All right, so then I moved to um, this transaction here. And I did this on my card that did not get a digital spend booster. And I wanted to take advantage of the buy four, earn back a $6 register reward and the awesome deal on the soft soap. So there's my two soft soap for $3.99 each, um, my two Charmin essentials for $4.95 each, and my two Bounty essentials for $4.95 each. So I used that $5 store coupon. It just comes off as a store discount. Both of my $1 digitals off of the Bounty and the Charmin came off. My two $1 coupons off the soft soap would not scan. Oh, OMG, I don't know why. The cashier was awesome and he went ahead and entered them because he could see that I obviously bought the correct product. My subtotal was $18.78. With tax, it brought me to $20.15. I used $20 in Walgreens cash. I literally only had to pay 15 cents for this transaction. I had my PayPal debit card ready to go. <laughs> the cashier said, are you really gonna swipe your card for 15 cents? <laughs> wouldn't even let me swipe my cart. He's awesome. I love him. He like hit cash or something on his system. He was going to find 15 cents in the store. So I just dug into my purse and grabbed out 15 cents to pay. I earned back $5 in Walgreens cash for buying the two soft soap. And I got back my $6 register reward. So if we take a look at this transaction, my subtotal was $18.78, plus I used a $5 store coupon, so my cost was $23.78. I earned back a $6 register reward and $5 in Walgreens cash. So that makes my cost $12.78 for these six products. But I had the $10.98 moneymaker over here. So everything you see on this table ended up costing me $1.80, which I think is pretty fantastic for four Listerine, for two soft soap, and for four paper products. So there you go. That's what I got for you today. Let me know if you're going to do some Activate Rewards Visa gift card promotions. Again, that limit is three, so I'll definitely be doing more. And what deals are you excited to pick up this week? If you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. I'm going to see you again soon. Bye.